So with the amount of uh, rise in the price of Bitcoin, there's quite a lot of attention paid to it and quite a lot of people ask, uh, I hear often, is it a good investment? Now, I think you need to put that into framework because this is A, the kind of thing that people ask all the time about all kinds of things, and B, uh, what's a good investment for one person might be a bad investment for another for all kinds of reasons. So it really comes down to who's doing the investing, why, and what are they all about. Uh, just the same as you could raise that point about a stock or a house or uh, in different regards, an education. And the fact is that Bitcoin falls into the category that is an emerging commodity, but still a commodity. It's got a little bit of a quality being special. So at one level, it's got a rare market that's a little bit like a lot of other things that are commodities that are rare, like maybe, uh, let's say, some forms of rare earths, which, of course, rare earths aren't really rare, but that's a different topic. They're treated as such. And then, more importantly, it doesn't do anything. People talk about it as a replacement for cash, a form of cyber cash, but to the extent that's really true, monies end up having to be stable value. So the question is, what's the price at which it's stable value? And no one really knows that. Therefore, it's a form of a speculation. And as a form of a speculation, there's nothing wrong with that for those that are good at speculating. Uh, there's nothing wrong with investing in commodities for those that are good at that. Uh, the question you have to ask, which is the same question that everybody always needs to ask when they think about investing in this, that, or the other thing, is markets, capital markets, pre-price all widely known information. You either know something other people don't know, or you get luck, good or bad luck. And in this, just said simply, the question you need to ask yourself always, and you know, this, I mean, another commodity that I'm asked about pretty often is cannabis. Uh, it's a commodity. Uh, there's a lot of people that use it. Um, people ask me, is it a good investment? I always say, what do you know about it that others don't that would be pre-priced? Because that's really the crucial function always when you're thinking about this. And for the most part, if you can't answer that pretty succinctly, I know this that others don't, that isn't widely known and therefore isn't pre-priced into markets, uh, you're just relying on luck. And if you're just relying on luck, then it's probably not a good investment unless you've got some big portfolio of things that you're able to oversee and this falls into a little piece of it. But for some people, probably a good thing. Subscribe to the Fisher Investment YouTube channel if you like what you've seen. Click the bell to be notified as soon as we publish new videos.